Hey guys, today I finally get to talk to you about Transformers War for Cybertron Earthrise. This is chapter two in the War for Cybertron uh, series. The first one was Siege. If you saw my review up here, you know it's one of my favorite, if not my favorite, Transformers cartoon anime show whatever you want to call it uh, i love it because it is so dark and gritty although somehow earthrise seems to get even darker and grittier oh i can't wait for you guys to see it it comes to netflix on december 30th let's talk about it spoiler free of course hey tessa from mama's geeky here thank you so much for stopping by my youtube channel all right guys this one picks up basically right where the last one left off but one of my favorite things about this chapter is that the Decepticons and the Autobots, they're in their own areas dealing with their own threats besides each other. So I feel like we get a lot more of them in their different places. Now, I don't want to give away too much because this is just like Siege, a very quick binge. Uh, you get six episodes that are 20 to 25 minutes each. Um, and I mean, you can binge it in less than three hours. So I feel like pretty much anything I tell you is going to be a spoiler. So I'm going to be very, very vague with this and just say that it is a fantastic follow-up to Siege. Um, I think I like it a little bit better. It gets a little bit darker and a little bit grittier, which I'm here for. Uh, although I think my favorite scene of the entire uh, series so far has got to be from Siege with the uh, body parts of the Transformers, like on spikes. That's just such a great visual, but this one has some fantastic visuals as well. Uh, the plot is crazy. My mind was blown. Now, apparently this is based on a book, which I do plan to eventually read. However, I don't want spoilers until I finish and chapter three will be coming out uh, probably in about a year, I would imagine. So once I finish up the series, then I will check out the book. Uh, but if you guys don't mind spoilers, of course, you can look that up. I, I searched it and I think it's just basically called like the history of the war for Cybertron or something along those lines. If you just Google it, you should be able to find it. Um, I do have it on order, but like I said, I am not going to read it until I finish up the series. But man, Earthrise was just so good. Uh, there was some things I definitely didn't see coming. I fell in love with Bumblebee even more. He was probably my favorite character of Siege, and man, he's, he's really, really great in this one too. Uh, although, I don't know, Optimus Prime... Optimus Prime's character arc and what Optimus Prime kind of did in Earthrise did make him, ew, it's him and Bumblebee are like this for me, for my favorite characters in, in um, Earthrise. But man, it's just really, really good. But like I said, you can binge it in less than three hours. So if you really like Siege, you're sure to like this one. Uh, it's one of the best uh, Transformers cartoons out there. I think it's fantastic. Now, it does come to Netflix this week on January 30th. I mean, December 30th. <laughs> now, it does come to Netflix this week uh, on December 30th, just in time for the new year. Uh, it's a perfect, perfect binge. Like I said, it's it's less than three hours, so you're going to be able to fly through it like that. Um, I thought it was absolutely fantastic. I love the arcs and the storylines. Each episode seemed to give me more and more and more. Of course, you're piecing the whole thing together. But, I mean, I felt like every episode had a really major high moment and then left us almost on a cliffhanger. So, I love when a series does that. It makes you just want to start the next one right up. I watched this literally, I binged it. I watched every episode back to back. And it almost plays like a movie. Now, there's a lot of movies out there that are basically three hours long. So, this really felt, truly felt like I was watching a movie. It felt like a theatrical experience. Um, it's just so fantastic. The story is great and I don't want to spoil anything because like I said, it's such a quick binge. I feel like pretty much anything I talk about is going to be a spoiler. Let me know if you are looking forward to this. Are you going to watch Earthrise on December 30th? Let me know in the comments, which Transformers your favorite. Let's talk and discuss. Like I said, a Bumblebee was definitely my favorite of Siege, but Optimus Prime is giving him a run for his money in Earthrise. Uh, I can't wait for you guys to see it so we can talk about it. Be sure to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on more videos like this one. As always, you can follow me over on Instagram and Twitter. I'm at Mama's Geeky over there. Thanks for taking the time to watch this.